All right. Uh, here at the Rattlesharp Compound, we thought we were going to be opening up Japanese today, but uh, apparently the mail has failed me and uh, my stuff didn't come. So still hoping and looking every day. I like having that feeling where you ever, every day you check the mail, see if something's in there. Uh, my stuff from Japan should get here shortly, but in the meantime, I was at Costco. Oh, what a... Uh, hate that freaking place. What a zoo it was today after the long weekend. They were closed yesterday, but uh, I specifically went down there because I needed a few things and uh, I wanted to get beat up by this again because apparently they have them on for actually better deal than but paid for the last one. Uh, this one here was uh, $57 Canadian plus tax. Uh, you know, going to go around 65 bucks somewhere in that Canadian. Uh, so if, uh, if you do the math or whatever, uh, I'm no good at doing that kind of math in my head, but uh, it was still pretty good per pack. I'm going to look that up right now for you. I do have to use a calculator. Give me a second. All right, I did check it out. And yeah, this is probably, I mean, the best deal going if you want to rip Sword and Shield. Apparently the hit rates on these boxes isn't the great, uh, greatest. I've only got one experience, but I uh, heard it through the grapevine that uh, other people were getting skunked by it. But that seems to be the way of things if you're ripping uh, Sword and Shield. Uh, hit rates, most of the chances are the packs you're opening are all reprints and they keep the uh, hit rates down to keep the population down and whatnot. But uh, you, you can still hit a banger uh, in this box. I believe we got Fusion Strike is uh, one of the oldest sets here. It's mainly Sil uh, Silver Tempest and uh, Lost Origin. But uh, let's rip into this sucker, see what's in here. And uh, I didn't even look to see. Can you even get the uh, the T-Tar big jumbo card? Not that I collect jumbo cards already, but I already have this Lucario jumbo. But, uh, and the plastic, the packaging for these things, is like Pokemon just does not care about the environment. <laughs> okay. Let's get these promos popped out of here. Again, sorry, I'm not going to share my code cards with y'all because uh, I'm uh, currently uh, in the process of building Mystery Pack. I'll let you guys know when that one drops. Um, okay, uh, I should actually pause the video and come up with a contest. Now, this contest is going to be for uh, North America only. I'm sorry, uh, I haven't uh, uh, checked out the logistics of uh, shipping around the world. The Rattle Shark here is on a bit of a budget, so... Um, and we pull out that uh, their jumbo over there, and uh, but yeah, let me go track down something worthy of you guys uh, actually trying for. Uh, I don't have that many subscribers right now, so if you enter this contest, you'll probably have maybe a one in ten, one in uh, one in four <laughs> chance of winning. But uh, I'll go pick something out, and uh, we'll put that in the mail. Probably we'll announce the winner on the next video, and. Uh, We'll see what happens there. And uh, okay, I'm gonna pause the video, come back, and I'll let you know what we're playing for. Okay, give me a second. All right, everybody out there in YouTube verse, Pokeverse, uh, the Red Shark has decided what he's gonna give away for his very first giveaway. This is my very first giveaway on the channel. So whoever wins this is gonna go down in history. Haha. <laughs> uh, so we're going to give away a little bit of a bundle of cards here. And uh, first off, we are going to go with <coughs> the promos that came out of this here pack. So we got the T-Tar V, we've got the Lucario V, uh, we've got uh, <coughs> the uh, Lucario and the T-Tar uh, uh, other promos there. And then also, well, oh, I just happen to have, have it lying here randomly on the desk, so I'm going to throw it in anyway. We've got a Regilecki V-Max. All right, and for the grand prize, uh, Professor Sada's Vitality Waifu uh, card, I think. Yep, Sada looks like it. Not a, a waifu, not a gaifu. Okay, anyway, that's going to be up for grabs. So uh, on uh, following the video, like, comment, I will do a uh, duck race. I'll film the duck race and uh, see who wins this. Uh, chances are it'll be on the, announce it on the next video or the following video after that. Uh, just uh, leave a like, comment, tell me which uh, set that you like, what was your best poll on the set. You know, doesn't really matter, just say hi in the comments. Like, BSD, also uh, another prerequisite, you have to be a subscriber. I'm uh, chasing that elusive 50 subscribers so that I can uh, possibly do a live stream for the first time. I'm a little intimidated about trying that on for size, but uh, you never know. I might be all right at it. The hardest part for me is going to be able to read the comments as they're scrolling by, like multitasking or whatever. But uh, I guess that's 
part of the thing of having uh, just a few people in the chat in the chat that when you start out you can actually start to learn how to do that properly. Uh, give these a separate, separate. Got to keep them separated. There we are. Lost. Oh no, Silver Tempest. Lost Origin. Silver Tempest. Lost Origin. Silver Tempest. Lost Origin. Astro Radiance. Okay, so we've got four Lost Origin. Five Silver Tempest, one Astral Radiance, two Brilliant Stars, and a Fusion Strike and a Pear Tree. All right, we are chasing Alt Arts. Going to visit some Sword and Shield. We're going to start off with Silver Tempest for the first pack. Let's hope we have better luck than the last time I tore into one of these uh, heavy hitters boxes. This one was at Costco. Uh, the price I paid for it was uh, four, oh yeah, four thirty, four fifty a pack. Uh, Canadian, uh, which turns out to be about three dollars and thirty three cents American, so it was a heck of a deal for uh, for uh, fourteen packs to buy them at that. Look at the bend on this pack; like they are actually damaged. Yeah, this pack was bent. Hopefully, that does not a trend for this box. Um, all right, we're gonna pull out the code card. And uh, we'll go four from the back. It's a V star card, so we don't have to worry about that. And uh, we got, see, Oop. Braxian, uh, got a little punny. Oh, I forgot to turn on this light. It'd probably help if I had that on there. Yeah, it helps a little bit. Uh, we've got Serena, V star card. Ponita, we got Routes, we got Venonat, we got Spinda, we got Pikachu with uh, more Peko, or no, sorry, Dedene chasing him there. Dedene, I like my Pikachus. Woohoo! First hit, first pack, magic! Woohoo! All right, what do we got? Raylan, is it? Yeah, this is a textured, this is a trainer gallery uh, textured one, so this is a full art trainer. That might be a good one. I'll have to look that one up and see if it's worth anything. And behind it, we've got a Noivern Reverse. Uh, well, the re okay. I'm actually going to have to look this one up, see if it's worthy of a top loader. Definitely worthy of a sleevey, but uh, we'll get that sucker in a sleevey. Ray, Ray Han. Ray Han. It's a decent looking card. What's he doing in there? He's just checking a ball. All right, let's go check the value on that baby. Uh, oh, well, we're going to take it anyway, but uh, I'm going to move this over so we can see Snorlax a little better. Yeah, there we go. Uh, it's only worth two bucks American. Oh, well. Well, I never did check to see if this card was damaged at all because of that bent pack. Uh, it is kind of bent, but it's not creased or anything like that. So I think uh, if we stuck this one, even though it's not worthy of a top loader, I'm going to stick it in a top loader, straighten out that curve there. Yeah, we do not want bends in our Pokemon cards. And that one does have a little bit of value. Again, it's really nice to look at these yellow borders. Uh, I do miss them. I, I, I'm not a big fan of the gray borders of the new, uh, of the current era. And I hope they, they rectify that and go back or change them to blue or red or something. The, the gray borders just seem boring to me. All right, next pack. Ooh, we got, I, ooh, wrong kind of code card. But that doesn't mean we can't get anything from the trainer gallery. All right. Yeah, we're going to go with uh, water. Fighting. Fighting energy. All right. We got Hunch Crow. Nine Tails. Uh, some sort of grass skirt. Leafy Camo Poncho. Okay. Beldum. Uh, we got Crow Gunk. We got uh, Solosis. We got Zubat. That's a cool looking Zubat, actually. Yeah. Elgin. And we got uh, Growlithe in the reverse, and this should be a non-hollow boink. Yep. Uh, it's the iPhone. iPhone. Fione. Okay, Silver Tempest again. Get into it. Come on, show me some Lugia love. Lugia love. Uh-oh, saw the code card again. Not a good one. But that is par for the course for... Uh, Sword and Shield, man, it, it, the hit rates are rough. 
been watching all kinds of guys like uh, Pokey Cuz. <laughs> that guy's been hit hard. That guy rips out so many so many packs per uh, per week, and uh, oh, that I was watching him do uh, fifty packs of. Uh, of uh, uh, evolving skies and it was brutal and then he 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 went degen and ripped a whole bunch more and he still he still got nothing there we go oh i forgot to guess it's lightning energy all right we got uh what's that guy's that is uh not reunclus do ocean do ocean yeah uh, do, do. noivern noibat sorry Toga, to, Toga Metric, or whatever, Torgamaro. Sandile. We got... Oh, Swirlix. <coughs> Pardon me. Don't even know. Hatterene? No. Uh, Mar, Marini. Marini. And in the reverse, we got Rapidash. And nothing behind it. All right, we are creating bulk. But I'm ripping packs. I wasn't even gonna go stop and buy packs, but I like I went the whole weekend without ripping a pack and I was just watching everybody else have all the fun for me and like code card. Oh not gonna look at the code cards because it's disappointing. One, two, three, four from the back to the front. And we're gonna go fighting. No, water. I guessed water and it was fighting, and now I guess fighting is water. <clears throat> Let's have a water fight. <coughs> Ooh, I've got a scratch in my throat. Might have to go get a drink. Mm -hmm. Some flora, Ralts. We got a Fletchling, Pratini, uh, Clink Clang, Clonk, Stunfisk, Fisk. Ooh, we got from the Trainer Gallery. We got the uh, <coughs> uh, Altaria Trainer Gallery card. Oh, it's something. I'll take it. And we got a, a freaking uh, Crocodile. Uh, regular hollow. Gonna pause it. I need a drink. I've got a tickle in the throat. <coughs> Oops, I accidentally hit stop on the video there. Uh, I'm going to have to uh, do some edi video editing, but uh, that part I actually already know how to do. So we're not, we're getting better with each video. I am, uh, yeah, I'm an old guy trying to learn new tricks and stuff like that. So, uh, you know, each video, I hope to add a little bit more and get a little bit more used to using the software, that kind of thing. Uh, it's kind of fun and a little bit intimidating at the same time. We're still opening Silver Tempest here. Uh, we are on pack number four, I believe. And we haven't hit anything too significant, but we're hitting at a 50% rate, so we'll take it. We've got a couple of Trainer Gallery uh, slot hits. Okay, four from the front. Boom, and we're gonna go Darkness. Ooh, steel. Steel energy. All right, going in. Well, Lord, right you. We've got uh, Emolga. Emolga. We've got Meditate. Routes. We got, uh, what is that guy? Durant. Durant, Durant. Uh, Fletchling. And we got a Dreadnought. Or no, a Dupider. Dupider. And come on, give me a hit. Show me the love. Ooh. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Uh, double it up on the Regilecki. The uh, one I'm giving away. <laughs> Question is, if you win, are you getting this one or the other one? <laughs> that is funny. Uh, for some reason, Regilecki wants to stay in my collection. <laughs> That's funny. Well, see, not bad. Not bad. We are three hits for four packs. Here comes pack number five. Or no, this is maybe pack number six. Uh, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine, and uh, ten. Yeah, five. This is pack number six. There was six. Six Silver Tempest. So, yeah. So we've got one, two, three. Fit is still hitting at a fifty percent rate. Not bad, not bad, not bad. We'll take that, especially from the Sword and Shield era right now. Oh darn it! Just saw it. I keep failing in that department. We're gonna go for you. Oh, I knew it was psychic too. As soon as I said fire, I knew it was psychic. <laughs> I actually did. <laughs> All right, there we go. Oh. The Dene. 
We uh Braxian? Yeah. I can't actually physically read them. I'm trying to look at the picture. Togo de Maru. We got uh, 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 uh Espert. Uh yeah, Smeargle. Uh oh, Litten. Litten. Uh we got Petalil. Petal Petalil, Petal Little, Petal Little, Petal Puddle, puddle. Okay, and the Neuvern. Oops, I'm knocking my bulk all over the place. All right, now we're moving on into Lost Origin, chasing the Garantina. Everybody think Garantina. Garantina. I think that's funny that I pulled the Regilecki again. <laughs> all right. <clears throat> Code card out. Oh. See, that one was backwards, and it was a good code card. One, two, three, four. I think they still did the code cards, uh, different borders for this set. Okay, we're going to go with fire again. Oh, grass, leaf. Do you say grass? Do you say leaf? What do you say? What is that one? Bloom. Oh, Hariyama. <coughs> Seal. Rock rough. Rosary, Roselia, Roselia, Litwick, Spinarak, and the reverse is a Trevenant going into, come on, show me it, boop, Mimikyu, dang it, I like Mimikyu, but I would prefer a better one than that, come on, show me some love, that pack was really easy to open, all right, code card out, one, two, three, four, we're going to go with... Voila! Fire! Seedra. Uh, <clears throat> that? Dottler. Some sort of thing. Clefairy. Slugma. Uh, Mawal. Gumi. We got a Gliglar. Gligar. Uh, was that Arcanine? In the verse, show me the Giratina. <laughs> Nothing. Hoopa. I got hooped with that pack. Hoopa hooped me. All right. Lost origin again. Oh, see, these ones are just tearing open like butter. Not like the Japanese set I just did the other day. Code card out. One, two, three, four. Voila. <laughs> Steel. Metal. There we are. Newsleaf. Some dude. Bronzong. Or Bronzor. Uh, Growlithe. Uh, Shalot. Shalos. Uh, we got Shubbit. Horsey. Mimikyu in the reverse. Come on, show me the love. Oh, man, we're just getting brutalized now. All right. All right, last pack of Lost Origin. Come on, show me that Giratina. Again, this pack just ripped open. So I'm guessing it's not a hit either. It was no struggle. Oh, there's, it did say it was a hit pack. Boink. See, some of these ones are backwards or forwards. Okay. We're going on electric. Steel, back-to-back -back steel. Get your metal on. Some worm thing. Uh, we got, what is that guy? Sligu. A chest. Mawal. Horsey. Murkrow. We got Rhinorn. Wurmple. Brasilia in the reverse. Show me that Giratina. Last chance for the Giratina. Boom. Show. And that, we are creating bulk sandwiches. Oh, that's the fusion strike. I want to open that one last. Going into Astral Radiance. All right, going after that food fight, Machamp. Alt art. I'll take any alt art at this point. Come on. All right. Uh, if this is the same, same as the last one, I have code card out. One, two, three, four. I am not buying another one of these sets. But if I if I hit good, I might. But I mean, bang for the buck. I mean, for 
350 uh, American per pack for Sword and Shield is pretty dang good. But uh, this set would be more worth by your while if you buy it at Costco and just uh, put it on the shelf and leave it there. Let, let it age for 10, 15 years and let somebody else find out the problem that there's no hits in them. <laughs> Sell it later on. Okay, we're going to go water. Oh, we got one right for the first time. All right. Oh, we got the... Eyeball booby weird snow thing. We got the cool fish. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Shout out Pokey Chit. <laughs> All right. We got the Rowlet. Oh, another one. Pokey Chit was just being trolled with those when I first started watching his channel. You know, this was the set that was out. Uh, we got the Pseudo Wudo. Uh, show me something lovely. Oh, right. We got another trainer. All right. That one does have texture on it, too. Grant. Grant. All right. It's been a while since we got a hit, so we'll take it. But I don't think this one is worth much. Uh, I'm going to go take a quick look to see if it warrants having a top loader. Narp. <laughs> Only wear the buck. <laughs> All right. Let's get into some brilliant stars. Finally, we can pull a Charizard. My buddy. I would hit the roof if I pull the, the Altard Zard here right about now. I'll take the full art one, too. That's a really good one. I think there's a rainbow in here as well, I believe, right? Isn't there? Correct me if I'm wrong. Okay, code card out. Not looking at the code card. One, two, three, four. We're going with electric fire. Come on, yes. Bring out that fire. Give me the Zod. All right. Starly. Spirit Tomb. We got a uh, uh, purloin. Uh, whatever that guy is. Uh, Sphinx. Snow runt. Show it to me. Nada. Oh, man. We are creating folk. Oh, I should move that out of the way. So, okay. Lots and lots of bulk. We didn't order bulk. Brilliant stars. One last chance. Bozardum. Alright. I love me my zards. Okay, code card out. One, two, three, four. Alright. Water. Pow! Fighting. Look the buzz. Halucha. Wazeal. Gobble goblet. Goblet. Giblet. Gibble. Trap pinch. We got a Luxio. Luxray, sorry. And we got the Charizard. Freaking just a raptor. It landed in my lap. Bulk, bulk, bulk. Come on. Show me that Espeon. Everybody's going after that. That uh, Gengar. I've already pulled the Gengar once, but I sold it, unfortunately. So I would love to pull it again and keep that sucker in my collection. Hindsight's always 2020 on that one. But I was chasing celebrations and I did trade it away for some product. All right. One, two, three, four. What a. Oop, I did that wrong. It's okay. It's still coming up. I called water. Persian. Fire. <laughs> All right. Come on, guys. Carvana. Oh. Um, Earl, Marpeco, Skarmory. Is that the reverse? No. That should be the reverse here. Uh, and Grim Snarl. Show me the Gengar! Actually, I said uh, Espeon. <coughs> oh, man. That sucked. Wah, wah. <laughs> All right. Let's recap. I just turned... Uh, <laughs> uh, well... 65 bucks Canadian into about six dollars in cards. <laughs> we got the railing for the best part, the best pull on the day. I did put it in a top loader only because it was bent a little bit. Uh, we got the Alteria uh, Trainer Gallery yellow border. We got the Regilecki because I was giving it away. He said, No, I want it to pay. And we got the Grant. Yes, we got, we started off really good, 
But then it went the way of Sword and Shield reprints goes. Well, that'll be the last time I buy with a heavy hitters box, unless I buy one and keep it for my collection. But knowing me, I will rip it. Okay, let's go back into it. All we have to do to win the, this week's uh, this uh, week's uh, contest is, uh, and you will get Professor Sada's Vitality, which is a really good uh, card. We will get the Regilecki V Max, the uh, Lucario and Tyranitar uh, uh, promos, the V promo, and uh, the other V promo. All all of those cards you'll be able to win. All you have to do is like uh, like and subscribe and comment on this video. And uh, we will announce in a future video who won and whatnot. Uh, so, yes, and that is eligible for North America only at this time. Once I figure out international shipping and what that's going to cost me, then I'll be uh, more inclined to uh, offer worldwide contests and stuff like that. Uh, as soon as I get uh, off my butt and make my uh, Rattle Shark packs, I'm still wait waiting on my um, graphics for my... Uh, uh, my cover on it and uh, once that's happening we'll be doing a lot more giveaways for Rattleshark mystery packs and then hopefully sell a bunch of those uh, I do put a, a lot of pride into making my packs I want a fair product so uh, the way my mystery packs are going to work is uh, one in four gets your money back right and one in ten is a banger one in 25 is a mega banger one in 50 is a god pack where every uh, every card is a hit and uh, will have a banger in uh, at least a banger in there and there'll be alt arts there'll be sirs japanese cards uh mainly stuff is going to be from uh, sword and shield to uh, uh the scarlet and violet era and stuff like that these are all cards that i pulled personally and uh on various people's channels uh, or uh, rip the packs myself but uh, anyway, I had fun ripping some cards with y'all here today. Hope you guys are having a little better luck than the Rattle Shark this week. Uh, anyway, keep on ripping and uh, keep it real. All right. Love you guys out there in the Pokeverse. Good day.